In this video, I'm going to be showing you how I broke down the newest map in R6, Emerald Plain. The strategies I used to learn it allowed me to become a beast at it after only a few hours playing it, and I've yet to lose it in rank since. It's a very simple system that's easy to use, and you can implement these techniques to learn any of the maps much quicker. There's really only two steps you need to maximize the rate at which you learn the R6 maps. First, think of an idea. The easiest way to do this is run a bunch of different operators and see what you could maybe use their gadget for. Second is to just try it out. You want to be continuously trying new and different things to get better and better ideas of what to do, but you won't be able to do that if you keep running a single operator or trying to do the same thing over and over again. Lastly, you'll want to take the mistakes and the bad rounds and try to understand what aspects of them were good and how you would change it to make it better. That doesn't mean you have to scrap the entire idea, just build off of it. This is how I did it for Emerald Plains. Nomad off the flanks, breach open the floor, clap the cheeks. Look at that. You can just clear out the whole site. Bruh. Yeah, I don't think repelling that ever is going to make sense whatsoever. I don't think this is ever the play. Just there's there's a fun fact. But this drone is super strong. What the fuck is this map? You're telling me he gets it upside down on this wall too? Everyone feeding in from a single breach is definitely not the move. But opening the breach and leaving a guy there is like why this can be so strong. You could open up that wall and then leave one guy there and rotate and open up another wall. And rotate and open up another door, another window. And then all of a sudden you have like angles on literally everything, you know? Oh my gosh, demon. Demon mode. Vertical play is of course a thing. So like opening up holes above. Like, bro. <laughs> all right, I'm in sight. But like, look at that. Those angles, I can see all the way back here. The other basement bomb site is definitely better, but I think that bomb site is probably the second best, which is the worst part. Say like, I'm actually contested taking above, you know? For that side, it's like you hold vertical, you stop them from being able to do what I just did. And then you probably just bunker site besides that. I don't know. Maybe you extend out horizontal as well. You can add so much pressure just to site by opening that outer wall. That's like you need people to stay there almost. Or you bring like a shotgun and play close on that door or something. So I think this is the best site because you can't do a lot of vertical play on it. And it's like pretty bunker heavy. See how the whole floor is like cement right now? But this one's soft, so this is the site you would want to push for if you are taking it from a vertical standpoint because you can actually open the floor on it, right? This guy's not real. Oh my gosh. Good luck, save me. Best site on this map right here, chat. I'm going to show you why. I'm going to show you why right now. So basically the way you should be playing this site is like... You hold it from B site because the entire floor of A is soft. Like they're gonna clear you out of A site if they're like good, you know? This might be a little advanced for like just starting on the map. But if you have someone hold this area and then you hold this area and open up this wall, like you just have control of the site, right? And then they have to push from here. I mean, this would be like, this would be probably the best way to push from because you can open above all of here, clear everyone out of this area and then plant like in the corner or whatever. This is just a, a defender side of gunfight. See that? I'm in cover. They have no cover. They can peek me all they want, but I, I got cover and they don't. Is it min or mine? I never know how to read it. This Cali is horrible. Wow. I just realized after like the fourth shot that Cali was shooting at me. And I was like, dude, how am I alive still? Because I think you need to hold fountain if you're going to do that. That way. So like the guy I was fighting when Cali shot me in the back that guy this is the guy that can test that guy so that that guy can't do that so i can just the guy behind the bar can just focus on the breach now i think castling this is probably the move boom you put a proxy here you cast off this you reinforce off this other single wall or you cast off all these and play it from that side Ooh, you could hold fountain from the opposite side you could do that oh this is, oh i kind of want to do that now yeah yeah because then you don't have to worry about the stairs so this stupid idiot 
Let's do this. Put a little beeper in there for some info. Castle off this. So we cast off square room and then maybe you have someone upstairs just roaming and fucking around over there. And then maybe cast off this. So like now I just got castles on castles on my backside. Don't have to worry about this as much. Put a proxy there and then I can just... Oh yeah, oh yeah. And then if they open this, I hop over here. But for now, I just have to worry about the stairs, right? Is this good? This is okay. Maybe a prox- oh, a proxy on these stairs would be good, actually. Somewhere over there. I don't know where, but... I don't think they know where the site is. Smoked. I'm playing Valorant. Can you guys tell how nasty I am after that shot? Do you guys just poop your drawers after that shot? Dude, die, man! It was. Okay, nice. Look at that! Stratted! Stratted! Obviously, that strategy was pretty horseshit. But it's a good start. It's somewhere to start, guys, and that's what matters, okay? It's a good start. For this one, you definitely want to, like, kind of set up over here a little bit. I think it's like you play here and fall off kind of thing. Oh, my... What is this? You're telling me an attacker can go in this window and hold this entire cross? You literally just can't move. This is a pretty good anchor spot because they can't break the floor or anything. Oh, my gosh. I'm terrified. I'm terrified, bro. Hit the cap cans, I dare you. They thatcher my cap cans, bro. Dude! <gasps> Secret hole. All right, we're gonna we're gonna get a drone in there, boys. I can't right now because I'm Mozzie, but that skylight is so stupid, bro. Guys, if you ever repel there, ever, and you get a kill, just know that you're actually horrible for repelling there. Oh. All right, I guess he opened the door already. How did he get through this little hole? What? Dude, this guy just spawned in this room. They added in dolphin diving in the latest patch? That's freaking crazy, bro. Oh, let's go! Oh! Bro, this is it. The stupidest thing I've ever seen. Oh, nice, nice fucking toss, bro. You guys are. Oh, oh! They're on me, I think. You found me gold. Now find me thirty lucky clovers. You know, a lot of PP, a lot of PP going around on this stream. This frostman is probably horrible, but I'm still gonna use it. So I'm gonna try to hold up top. I'm gonna try to hold up top. I don't know, I know exactly what I will be doing with vertical play though, which is the tough part. But I'll kind of use my mats up here to help me out. And then I'll try to make some, like, vertical holes that can support my teammates. Hopping in this window makes no sense when the door is like that because the door is way more cover and stuff. Oh, see, this would be good. This would be good. Reinforcing these walls, holding it from here. Because you can hold the breach from up here, right? I think I learned a thing or two doing this. Dude, he's got a shield out, man! I can't even kill him with the shield! Downstairs. Oh, he was on the right side. I thought he was on the left side. I think Osa would actually be crazy because there's a lot of crossfire angles. So just setting up a shield on one and holding another is probably a really good way to do it. All right, and I can just do this. So now I can't get peeked from there. I can sit and hold this cross all day. Bro, I am on the hunt right now. Really hoping my boy does something real, real quick. There it is. Watch this. It's the post plant. I think I can see bomb from here. Maybe not. Oh, no, I can't. It's on the other side. I just got told good night, bro. What? I'm just entry thermiting right now. Oh, my whole game just stuttered. Don't know where that guy came from. All right, let's hit the rotation station chat. Whoa. What the fuck? 
That was crazy. I love that run out. Wow. We gotta sell down now. I get it, man. I get it. It'll be okay. All right. Can't flank me. Bro, I might just beam this guy in the back of the head if he doesn't fuck off. I'm not gonna lie. Bird play. Bird play on the side is huge. Look at that. You can just clear out the whole site. So rather than hold, holding um, vertically, I'll extend out horizontally. Probably open that kitchen wall up, I think. So I'm going to open up this wall. And I'll almost hold it from, like, courtyard. So that way I can see I can see the pushing over here. I can extend out over here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to castle this. Reinforce off this. Now, the only concern I would have would be, like, this window above me. Which I could run up and castle, but... <laughs> I guess I'll just <laughs> throw a beeper on it. No, I think ideally I do the uh, the double window upstairs. So we'll pretend that we'll pretend like I used my last castle right here, okay? So I went up and did it, and then I can play from here. So now I can hold this from over here, but I can also peek this and hold like kitchen. Fart. The sledge kind of really messed up my living situation. I, I I have the pocket castle. I got the pocket castle, chat. Oh, he was in the freezer. How did? What was going on here, man? What was going on? In fact, I can just sit here and all this is ridiculous. <laughs> wow! What a nade! What a nade, bro! That's the power of droning right there, chat. This is the Poxall Mox certified I would have died to this spawn peak. Now that's if they spawn here. I got it. Kinda. It was rough, but I got it. Fucking cat can. Well those cap can that cap can elite is actually makes them pretty hidden. I don't really know what I, oh my god all I know is that is not how it's done look at me sledging walls and smashing balls so I can hold the double door from above if I don't die that is The audio is so strange. Bomb has been loaded. LMG meta is just ridiculous. Since Ace here. So, um, apparently LMGs are just as good on this map as they are every other map. So we can confirm that for you there, guys. There you go. Fuck. I'm good. I'm good here. The bar's a safe place. This is my happy place, chat. I found my happy place, chat. Let's go. Here comes our first victim, Bandit. There it is, dude. Like, the fact I can do that is not, not, is not real. All right, let's get some action going here, chat. What am I shooting at? What am I shooting at? Yeah, flash by me, baby. I'm planning in the middle of the site. A hundred balls. That's how many balls I have. A hundred. 
Oh my gosh, the pistol tap to the dome. So let's go over and actually open the uh, outer wall this time. I feel like just in general, if you're not opening the outer walls, you're kind of trolling. Because there's so much pressure So for, for no cost. Tons of pressure, takes no time. Easy money. So then if we rotate and open this wall now, like I think I'm gonna do that actually. Almost died for the worth. Oh, he's on the stairs behind me. Well, I mean, ideally I have teammates helping me do that, right? I just wanted to kind of paint the picture for you guys. Wow, that guy got beamed. Like picture these two guys were clearing with me over on that staircase, like clearing out that Jaeger so that I could thermite that wall open. Wow, the possibilities, chat. The possibilities of that. 